Fix yourself some donuts and coffee and stuff. It's time for another two minute tech tip. My name is Anabin and today I have a Java microservice with just provided dependencies only and a Jaxorus resource which exposes this pink object as a JSON. <laughs> what I would like to do is to uh, play a little bit with exceptions. The service is available via curl. So uh, now it is deployed, h42 and named Duke and the whole war was deployed in four seconds and this is a uh, four kilobyte thin war. So now what I would like to do is to create an exception and uh, the exception is throw new no pink today exception and see what happens. So the exception is uh, lazy, lazy. So and then I would like to create the exception and we have the exception and this is going to be a runtime exception, not a checked one. And what I would like to do is just to pass it to super lazy. So now uh, this is done, no pink, lazy, done. This is recognized and deployed. And now try that. And I got no output, but actually I get 500, which is ugly. So, um, and what I would like to do instead is to make it more manageable. Let's say this is, should be a bad request for 100 because I'm too lazy. So what to do? I would like to change that into web application exception. And now what I can do, I can say, I can now create a response with um, the, um, this is uh, going to be status. And the status is going to be 400 and I can even add additional header information with uh, uh, reason uh, laziness and then called build. So now with that, I will try it again. And now it's deployed. I get bad request reason laziness. So I can even add additional information in the headers and there is no exception mapping needed a very uh, nice and thin way to handle errors and exceptions was that a good tip tremendous we want your opinion thanks for watching and stay tuned